obviously another tough loss tonight. You guys have given up 40 points in three straight games. What has been going wrong with the defense of late? Um, I mean, sometimes uh, uh, it's just how the game goes. Um, I mean, being put in bad, bad spots. Uh, I mean, we got to work our way out of it. I mean, we can't, we can't bend, we can't break. Uh, I mean, we can't allow ourselves to lower our standards because of I mean, because of what goes on in the game. I mean, we just got to keep playing up to our standard the whole time. And I mean, I think we'll, I think we'll be fine. So coming to these games, it seems like everybody's fired up and motivated, and but you're down 17 nothing so quickly, two straight weeks. What does that do emotionally to the team? Uh, I mean, honestly, it's demoralizing. I mean, uh, we work hard all week. Um, I mean, everybody in tune to the game, in tune to the game plan, and then to go out there, and I mean, to have a start like that. I mean, it's just it's just like an energy drainer for the team. But I mean, we got to find a way to work out way out of that hole. I mean, when that does happen, we got to find a way. Somebody got to make a play, and I mean, flip the flip the tables around. I mean, it has to happen somewhere for somehow. With well, that energy drain, is that just on the sideline or is that on the field too? Can you feel that on the field? Uh, no, nah, not on the field. I mean, I think it's just more of a sideline thing. I mean, because the sideline is where most of that energy comes from, unless somebody's making a play on the field. But I mean. <sighs> Just on the field, I mean, we're playing hard uh, all four quarters. I mean, we're just not executing at the moments we need to and making too many mistakes. Uh, we can't really afford those mistakes right now. You have two games left to uh, keep the bull streak alive. How important is that? I mean, that's super important. I mean, that's the only thing that's on our minds right now. I mean, that's the main thing coach is talking about, uh, making sure these seniors go out with a bang, making sure we finish the season how we're supposed to, uh, not ruining the legacy, not ruining the dynasty, all of that. I mean, it's huge for our program. I mean, um, we we definitely want to be the ones looked at as the ones that ended the bowl streak. So we definitely got to keep that going. Did you guys change in the secondary in the second half? Uh, I mean, he made a couple adjustments. Uh, we've seen that. I mean, their, their quarterback wasn't uh, wasn't really making tough reads. So I mean, we kind of made it made it a little easy on ourselves. Uh, I mean, allowed ourselves to create a couple turnovers. Uh, I mean, we just got to find a way to start to run better. And I mean, not make those mistakes at critical moments. What do you, as far as stopping the run, how much of it is just physicality, being finishing tackles, or, or or is it still not not getting the right gaps? Um, I mean, I don't think it's, it's definitely not physicality. I mean, uh, guys out there being physical, uh, nobody's shying away from contact or anything like that. But I think it's just more of everybody just knowing their fits and knowing where they fit on certain plays that are called. And I mean, certain offensive formations change where that where that hole may be. I mean, it's just knowing. The adjustments off of based on what the offense formation is. Yeah.